This video is to show you how to project a shapefile. In this case, I have two shapefiles. One of them I'm going to project. I'm going to look at them first and help you decide which, how to tell if it's okay to project. I, I'm going to tell you right now, I'm going to project Tacoma neighborhoods, but the reasons why this is, in order to project, there must be a coordinate system, which means there's no way that I should project places Y at this point. It's impossible to do because it's undefined. I'm going to project because this shapefile or layer, Tacoma Neighborhoods, already has a projection, but it's in the wrong projection. It's not the one that I want, so I'm going to project it. I could not project places Y yet. That one needs to be defined first, and there's another video for that. In this case, I'm going to project Tacoma Neighborhoods. In Arc Toolbox, Data Management Tools, Projections and Transformations, Project. I input the data set, and it already tells me that this is NAD 1983, State Plane, etc., etc. That's good because if it was unknown, I wouldn't be able to project. I now choose the name of the new layer, and in this case, it should not be going to my C drive. You almost never save to your C drive unless it's your own computer. Go back to my lab 3 where I'm going to be saving all of this. In my data folder. And in this case, Tacoma Neighborhoods is probably already there, which means I'm going to click Tacoma Neighborhoods Project and add an extra underscore 2. Do I know it's the second one? The output coordinate system that will usually be provided, but I'll tell you right now that for this one I'm going to use UTM NAD 1983 Zone 10N because that is perfect for Washington if I want to use Universal Transverse Mercator. I say OK. In this case a green light does not pop up or it's circled next to Geographic Transformation meaning there is none needed. In this case, I would just say OK. It said project, project, project down here, and a little green arrow popped up, a green check mark on the far right of my screen. You could not see that, but here is my shape file. And now if I look at it, it is now in the new projected coordinate system, NED 1983 UTM Zone 10N. That is perfect. That is how you project. 